Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Story Mode. Last time we left off in the swamp very, very near to Ivor's fortress or um, laboratory. So we are we stopped here at the swamp to get some food. And yeah, let's get going. Let's see if we can grab some food. So let's head over here to this these potatoes. And this potato will bring us some food. So let's take. I don't want to eat it because of course I want to save for my friends. So I'm not going to eat it just potato, yet. Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. And there's some potatoes over here. I do not know why there's random potatoes growing in a swamp. I'm pretty sure in Minecraft there's no potatoes growing in swamps, but I mean, you never know. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Witch's hut. Ah! We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's that's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? <laughs> Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. And they know these swamps far better than I. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. A potion of leaping. Cool. Your cake, nice. <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah. Ow! Ivor! Ivor? <laughs> Jesse, we need assistance. You! Witch! Everyone, let's get out of here ASAP! Ivor said the Far Lands are just past the swamp. Wait! Where is Ivor? I thought he was with you. He was separated. He'll have to catch up later. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! Guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh. Wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. Glad Jesse snagged this cake. Makes the whole wall of insanity thing a lot easier to face. Say what you like about witches. They sure know how to make a cake. Hmm. Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. Like a monument to chaos itself. Soren, have you been here before? Not here specifically, but I have visited the Farlands. The Order traveled far and wide during our heyday. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. How 
can Ivor live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wool world inside the end, but this... Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or... I don't know. Some way around. We followed Ivor to the Far Lands. We might as well keep going. Here we go. Into another dungeon of doom. thing I've ever seen. The far lands may be perilous, but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving. Guys, looks like this is a... Jesse! <laughs> There's too many! We can't fight them all! Everyone, back! of leaping! <sighs> Guys! Caught in the vines! <laughs> well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there. Olivia!
What's that? I don't see a way across. Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <laughs> I thought I'd never find you. All those dead ends back there. Am I glad to see you guys? Us too. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <coughs> this maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? <coughs> I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, at least we're back together. Yes! The Dream Team reunited! <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it, though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a look. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she's the greatest redstone engineer ever. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name, none of them give Eligard any respect, and Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. All I know is the world is depending on us. Then maybe the world is in trouble. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Well, for starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You and I found Eligard together. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse! Take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so.
Okay, a redstone block. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. It must be this way! Run! Go, go, go! Quick, onto the barge! That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> Soren, is that true? Of course not! Ah. <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. So many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew? Potionology, volume 24? None of these are enchanting books. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs, revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. None of these seem to be enchanting books either. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. That first night we all spent together? Yeah, and I miss Petra. She was the best of us. But she was healthy, anyway. I really hope we can cure her. I hate seeing her so sick. Me too. We all do. So? I guess let's just keep looking for that enchanting book. Yep. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't gotten lost in that confounded swamp. He could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. He was just doing what I asked. It wasn't his fault we got separated, not really. Is that supposed to make me feel better? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. Reuben, what are you doing? 
<laughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. <laughs> Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. Wood planks, those will be useful. This Ivor character, I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the Wither Monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? What do you remember? I seem to recall that Ivor was better with potions than people. And he, he... Keep going. Ah, nothing else is coming. Besides the whole Ivor being a jerk thing. Potion of blindness, potion of dullness, potion of nausea. None of these will help me. Jesse, am I going to be all right, or is this just who I am now? Always struggling to remember what I was. Of course you'll be okay. You're Gabriel the warrior. Thank you, Jesse. Your confidence in me is stronger than any potion. Except perhaps a potion of confidence. I wonder if he has one of those. First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, got the sticks. There we go. Good old-fashioned lever. Like, it was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits. More like why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there! We'll head down and see what we can find! Whoa! What is all this? Ha! Huh, incredible! He's gathered them all in one place! Gathered what, exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. Prismarine crystals? You gotta be kidding me! These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item? We might need it to unlock that door. 
Uh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery! These gas tears, they're super hard to get! You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Just gotta borrow this. Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh. Alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Any idea how this hopper thing is supposed to work? I have no clue. Ivor can be very confounding when he wants to be. Alright guys, I know I haven't talked the entire episode, but this is going to be the end for today guys. I'm really sorry, we don't get to find out what happens just yet, but we've gone long enough today so guys i really enjoyed myself today hopefully you guys enjoyed yourselves and if you did make sure to like and comment as a support of my channel and i'll see you guys later god bless and goodbye